Hey guys, this is Hennio with uh, Hennio Talks. The dog's out here today, so if you hear any noise, it's because uh, he's very responsive to my voice. Um, today I wanted to talk about uh, intuition. Intuition is very, uh, it's very, it's a, it's a very powerful thing and it has a lot of implications for life. Uh, most of the time, or, or in the world, people People have associated intuition with women. You know, they have the, the same mother's intuition. Uh, that's all very true. Uh, what I've come to realize is that intuition is when you're when you're put into another person's perspective. So you develop intuition. This is a developed skill uh, when you learn to care for someone. Uh, you know, uh, guys uh, they don't traditionally uh, uh, they're not caring they're not caring for somebody traditionally. Uh, you know, like like a mother is, and so they that they, they don't. It's more of an, a skill that takes active learning. You have to kind of go go out and do it. But once you do, once you do care for someone uh, over and over, different people, you do develop intuition. Uh, maybe uh, if you're caring for one person, uh, you, you get an idea of what their uh, my eyes, my glasses are crooked. You get an idea of what is um, uh, what is driving, you know, what is what is uh, in their minds, and so you care for them, and that, that's intuition. Now, intuition though uh, can come. Can then, can then be a, applied to everything else, not just uh, your relationships and your bonds, the people you care about, but uh, the environment as well. Uh, it's a very good skill to have. Uh, they teach it in other things, not just the mother's intuition, but that's one way that it's easily recognized. Once again, intuition is this core thing, and we try to layer it with uh, different, under different understandings so that we can... Uh, you know, uh, uh, you know, come up with a mutual way to be able to discuss it and just uh, and grow on it. We need a secure foundation for growth to happen. So, uh, with intuition, it comes a lot. You just pick up on things. It's just from uh, from experience. Once you've done something, you know everything that's associated with that. Once you've uh, you've had a lot to drink, you know what it's like to have a hangover the next day. You know what it's like, for example, to go on the first day of school and, and have to take all your your items in the uh, in a plastic brown bag. They did that in the '90s. I don't know if they still do that uh, nowadays. Oh, so they do something different. But there's always uh, traditions, little things that. Uh, but if you pick up on those. If you're alert as you're doing them, live in the moment because you have a lot of no baggage. You're in the moment. You're able to. It's able to. He wants you to play uh, football. Uh, you're able to live in the moment, and then you can have no baggage and uh, and just and and thrive. I kind of lost my train of thought there. Uh, but coming back to intuition. Uh, not not everyone has it. It's a developed skill, and so. Uh, when, when people lack into it, we can look at both sides. We can look at people that have a strong intuition. You, you know, we talked about uh, ignorance is bliss. Those are, that's kind of the lack of intuition. Uh, if you have a lot of uh, knowledge, a lot of it comes from intuition and wisdom is, is this. It's from talking to people. Uh, people talk about experience. They talk about maturity. It's all kind of tied in. We have to have a way of understanding it all together. And uh, what I've come to, to realize is that... Uh, Maturity comes from experience. We associate mature, uh, age with experience and maturity, and uh, we think that uh, as you get older, you know, you get you, you you become wiser, and that's all very true. What happens is actually due to interactions uh, that you have, experiences, and those can happen through 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 different things, such as reading, such as uh, watching movies, engaging with friends, talking to them. You become a very empowered individual, and, um, and you develop an intuition because you're getting in, all, in everybody's is heads, and so you have a. There's a lot of active exercises that can be done to train your mind to learn in general to become a better person in, in, in any way you want you can you can direct your growth if you want to be a, a, a sexual goddess or, or, or God you can do that if you want to like be a, 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 a genius mathematically or just uh, technically in some way there's a lot of things you can do with that now you know intuition this was just a brief video we're gonna be diving in more uh, you know as uh, this helps to get it out, get the thoughts going in my head as well. But um, so uh, ignorance is basically ties into intuition, and the more intuition that that you have, um, the more knowledge you have. Uh, and uh, sometimes you have to. Not all people have a lot of intuition. 
or we're not trained that way. Uh, and so when you know a lot of things and you pick up on things, uh, sometimes you can't always uh, re reveal it all. It's not it's not healthy to you have to weigh the benefits, the the not the gen not just the benefits. You have to weigh the outcome in general. And so uh, everybody try to stay balanced, try to stay um, connected with the world at bay. Uh, it'll give us a harmony. That's all that, that that's trying to happen. We are energies, and we're just trying to. You know, uh, become one with the world around us. It, it has a natural way that it's flowing, and we just want to try to stick with that way. Uh, so that's what all these videos are for: is to help everybody just uh, be at peace with themselves. It's all about perspective. We'll talk more about uh, intuition, the universe, and perspective in future videos. Uh, this is Henio. Thanks for watching. Uh, uh, this is Henio Talks.